Hello eBay, how you doing? Today we have a beautiful Waltham trench watch with a Riverside Maximus movement, which has diamond cap jewels. It's 19 jewel movement. It's a zero S size. It is a very rare movement. I have seen this movement go and sell for anywhere between 250 to $350 by itself. Um, we have a beautiful Fahis Monta case which is actually pretty rare because this one has 12 millimeter lugs and um, the case is much wider than your standard trench watch case. I believe it's just about just under 34 millimeters when other cases are about 31, maybe 32. Um, as you know, Joseph Fahis made some amazing cases during the war. Um, as you can see, this is, I mean, this is running great. I mean, all positions. I mean, just what you should expect from a movement of this caliber. All positions. Um, the dial, let's go into the dial. The dial is a very rare, bold Arabic red 12 dial. Um, there is a, can't really tell, but you can look better in the pictures. There is a slight chip uh, by the sub second dial, as you can see it. There is a hairline right there. And then if you, you can't really see them, but if you look on an angle in the sun, there are two other hairline fractures in the dial. Um, hard to see because there's really no dirt in them or anything. Um, I did clean the dial a little bit, make it a little bit better, but there's definitely a hairline here. And then there's like, I think one or two going like that, but you can't really see them. Uh, and then, like I said, there is a chip right there. Um, either way, I mean, this dial so rare. I mean, if this dial was in mint condition with zero cracks on it, I mean, these things can fetch up to $500. I've seen them sell for about $500 on eBay before. Um, even ones with cracks go for about $200, you know, because somebody will be willing to pay someone two, $300 to refurbish the dial because they're just so rare. Um, the band, I... It's a handmade band. I made the band. It is a 12 millimeter. It's made out of World War II ammo pouch leather. Okay, so it's custom made band. It should accommodate any wrist size. Um, and uh, that's pretty much it. Uh, I guess, you know, the crown winds the watch. As you can hear it, changes time, no problem has a good click in in the uh, case sleeve so yeah thanks for looking